Sometimes to get the job done fast and right and move on to the next job, you have to pick quick. This is another tool that lives in my EDC pouch, my everyday carry pouch to those of you not in the know. For me, this tool, this screwdriver, is best used in conjunction with my DeWalt 8 volt gyroscopic screwdriver, which I'll throw a link to my review of that over in the corner here. I'll also link to that review in the description. So this screwdriver does double duty in my workflow. First off, by itself, I'm carrying seven screwdrivers in one convenient little package. Secondly, as I said, working with this, it uses the same style of bit. So everything I carry in this is usable in this, and that makes these two together amazing. There isn't really much to the Pit Quick Six Pack Plus, and that's one of the things that makes it so useful. It's got an ergonomic handle, it feels good in the hand, you're not going to gouge yourself or some of the other issues that you'll have with screwdrivers. It just feels, that the handle feels like a normal run of the mill single screwdriver. It's good, it's solid. I never feel like I'm going to break the screwdriver itself. I have broken some bits, but in fairness, I don't use pick quick bits and I'll get to that in a moment. The way this thing works, you just pull the tip you're using out Find the bit that you're looking for, take the bit that is now in your hand, push it through the back of the handle, and pull the bit that you want out, drop it in. There's a nice magnet in here that holds it in place, and you're good. Now you have a screwdriver. And in my experience, this feels like you're using a standard run-of-the-mill screwdriver. It doesn't feel like you're using a multi-bit screwdriver. Some of you will know what I'm talking about. Those just feel cheap, they feel weaker. While, like I said, I've broken some bits, I, because I'm working around other things a lot, I, if you've worked around doorknobs very much, you'll understand you're kind of hitting things from an angle a lot of times. And so I use rounded bits that I get somewhere else. The, I do use a couple of pick quick bits, and those have stood up amazingly well. I've had this for about four years now. Again, it's in my everyday carry pouch, and all of the bits still hold in place really well. There's no, I mean, the magnet still holds strong, no, no problems there. One important feature that I don't particularly use a lot because I don't, I don't have a lot of need to get a lot of torque on something, but you've got this 7 16 uh, hex part up here. You can put a box wrench on or channel locks or you know, whatever you want to use and really crank it down. But that's, I, I typically don't with this. In my experience, the Pickwick screwdriver is exceptionally well made. It's held up great for me. While I was looking on various websites to find any information I could about, about these screwdrivers, I started thinking maybe I should buy a couple of more. They're inexpensive. They last really well, and they're remarkably useful. I, I couldn't be happier with this particular purchase, and I'm probably gonna, I'm, I'm probably gonna buy some more. This is one of those things where uh, I should carry this in my everyday pouch, I should carry this in my lockout pouch, I should have a couple in random places, and I should definitely be carrying one in my, in my camera bag. Uh, I think I'm gonna do that. I told you, so it must be true. For anyone who's missed it, I've started putting affiliate links in the description. Uh, full disclosure, it costs you nothing extra, but if you use those links, I do get a small commission. So, eh. Well, I think this is gonna be a short review today. There's not really a lot of complicated things to cover with this screwdriver, but I love it. Some of my friends have pointed out that I keep talking about tools that I really like, and I don't have a lot of criticisms. Well, at this point in the tool reviews, 
I'm mostly covering things that I have just tested and tested and tested. And when I say tested, I mean I use them every day. So obviously if this is what I'm carrying, I'm a fan. I will eventually start reviewing things that are newer to me, uh, that I haven't used as much, and those I'll probably have more complaints about, at least some of them. But for now, I'm, I'm still covering things that, man, I really love. Things that, as always, save me time, save me hassle, save me energy, help me get the job done right and fast, and then move on to the next job. And uh, as always, remember to like, share, and subscribe. Comment, talk to me in the comments. I'm on the road a lot, but some days I have a fair amount of downtime, and really, social media is driving everybody crazy. I'm no exception. Let's talk tools. Tell me what you like. Tell me what you don't like. Tell me what you'd like for me to cover. I'm open to suggestions for reviews. I would love to hear your thoughts on anything that I'm reviewing, using, or you think I should review or use. Sometime soon, I'm going to hopefully, hopefully, have a treat for everybody. Uh, I'm hoping to go see my buddy Bender. Great guy, we've been friends for almost two decades now. He knows tools, and he's much harder on things than I am. Hopefully you'll get to see that soon. Bender, I'm coming for you, buddy. And I'm Trent with Columbus Key, located in Columbus, Indiana. We're a commercial and residential locksmith service. If you need your house rekeyed, your business rekeyed, you need some fire exit devices put on your doors, need some door closes adjusted or just put on, you lock yourself out of your house, your business, or your car, give us a call. We're happy to help, and I'll see everybody next time. Thanks.